Good morning, and welcome to Morning Mario here on Steven Plays. Today, we have a Super Mario Brothers themed level called Silence in the Library, created by Joe. Good old Joe. A world record of 48 seconds and a clear rate of 31%. It seems like a fair amount of people are good at being quiet in libraries. Which I would hope, because if not, they would piss off, piss off my buddy Thomas. Oh, this is Doctor Who. Oh, also, I like the, the little uh, TARDIS there. Oh god, I'm in- oh, I'm- Don't know if I was supposed to do that. Yep. Yeah, I'm, uh... Am I trapped? <laughs> I mean, to be fair, I think, thematically, that this would still fit. Because of everyone who could break through <laughs> the barriers of time and space, it would probably be- probably be the doctor. So, can I do a tiny jump and hit this? Okay. I don't, I don't think it even does anything, but the fact that it could amuses me to no end, so I wanted to hit it and just run as fast as I could to see if it did. Okay, it doesn't. But it amused me to no end. Alright, let's see. Uh, what's it saying? Hello? Sweetie. Hello, sweetie. There's gonna be... There's going to be references I do not get, because I have not seen the, uh, the show. But, uh, Doctor Who's super popular, and I'm going to rely... F I'm going to rely on you guys to point out the different, uh, references. Ice cream. It's completely lost. I should probably... I should probably have had Mal join me for this one to explain exactly what it was we're seeing. I love the doctor costume, though. Like, I'm literally a doctor. I'm a medical doctor. There's all of these, like, weird triangle things that have got things in them. And then there's sky demons. Like, the only things I really know of from the Doctor Who universe are, like... Fart. I knew that was gonna happen. Are the, are the Daleks and the Weeping Angels. And that's... That might be it. Not entirely certain. Um, e... Ev every... One... Saved. Okay, so... In the overworld part, whenever we were in the... Level selection, there was a part that says everyone saved, and then like 4022 saved, or something. And I didn't really understand that, but it looks like there's a way to save less people? Let me get, let me go back in, because I'm slightly perplexed. So if we go this way... <laughs> what? What? Okay, hold on. Can you, you... I guess you can't go that way, but like... Okay. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. Oh my god. Um... Alright, well in that case, we still have, uh, it's only been a few minutes on this episode. I think I'm going to at least give it a, uh, a very true speedrun attempt. So let me start over. Let me crack my knuckles. She thought I was joking. I wasn't joking. And, uh, let's do this thing. Okay, I screwed up. I probably could have saved a second or two, because I kept getting caught on really dumb crap. But... Do so you know how I got caught on really dumb crap? Yeah, that really dumb crap cost me. I totally could have beaten that world record. Son of a gun. I did it. I did it. I did it. I did it. I knew I could do it. 
It was just a matter of not getting caught on those little lips and things like that. Yeah. Awesome. Good. Good thing has happened. That you you could still beat that. There's there was at least one or two parts where I still did, you know, trip a little bit. So that's that's beatable. But that's pretty close. You ain't going to be able to beat that by a whole lot unless you figure out some some way to run along the ceiling in a way that actually works. Anyway, that is it for today. Thank you so much for watching. If you have a level of your own that you would like to submit, or if you want to play these submitted levels to help rate them and decide what gets shown on future episodes of Morning Mario, you can do both by heading over to MorningMario.com. Once again, thanks for watching, and I'll see you tomorrow for more Stephen Plays Morning Mario.